Yo, yo, guys, Icky here, back again making another video, and today I'm sorry if I sound a slight bit congested or something because I've got a slight cold or whatever, and my ear's slightly blocked, so I'm not sure how loud I'm really talking. But I mean, yeah, guys, welcome to the, to the channel, and today I'm going to be doing the best tech of April 2017. This is a long awaited video, and I promise you I'll try and get the May and June editions and stuff like that to be earlier on, on time. So yeah guys, just bear with me. But today we have the best tech under $25. So yeah guys, without further ado, let's get into this video. And guys, don't forget to check out G2A.com for the cheapest CD keys available for all different platforms, Xbox, PSN, PlayStation. I'll leave the link in the description. So guys, for the first piece of tech, we have a mouse by a company called Inca. It's like a, a gaming mouse and counts as a combo with a gaming mouse pad. My, my full unboxing and review video for this would be coming out shortly and I got it from Turkey and if you'd like to check out my Turkey vlog I'll leave a link in the card I'll try and whatever. But you know, go check it out and uh, it is a great mouse. The LED's got like around 7 LED colours comes with a CD for programming, like those colours, several like keys, has about three, four buttons on it which you can program to do whatever you want, which is quite nice. It feels like a proper like razor or cross-eye mouse, but it comes in around um, 15 bucks, maybe some around that price point, 15, 20 bucks, so it is quite a steal for in my opinion. For the second product for today, we have the Mighty Mug, and I have done a review and unboxing of this several months ago. I'll leave a link in the card on all my other tech videos. But this is essentially your tech, but it's not a piece of tech. But like, essentially, it's just a mug, like sort of like a, you know, one of those mugs that keep your, like a thermos, and it just doesn't fall over. You can keep hitting it as much as you want, but it just doesn't fall over. You just got like a sort of you know, like a box, like, kicking it, and probably will fall over, but, you know, day-to-day -day use is perfect in your office or whatever, and you spill over all your PC parts or whatever, just, it's great, and I use it all the time, for my coffee or whatever that I'm drinking. So, for the third piece of tech today, we have a power bank from the company Icon, and I buy quite a bunch of stuff from Icon, they sell TVs, monitors, Power banks, headphones, speakers. I think I have those speakers here. Right. No, it's from Intex. I do like Icon. They're an okay company, and they make quite a good bunch of budget stuff. But this is a power bank, which is, I believe, 16.5 k milliamps. Let me just quickly check. 15.6 k milliamp. 15. 15,600 milliamps, guys. So this should give, let's say, like an iPhone or something, around five charges. So that, that's quite decent, I think. And you can carry it where it's sturdy and hard. I think it's a little bit too thick for my liking, but uh, a bit heavy. I mean, this is for my mum. I don't really use something that heavy. I have like a 12,000 milliamp. But if you are like a power user, recommend this heavily. It's not like a 20k milliamp, but it's between like a 10 and a 20 so it's good i think it's really good and i do recommend it heavily it comes with two usb ports and charges via micro usb as a bunch of other devices power banks most of them do so yeah for the final piece of tech today we do have a pair of bluetooth headphones which come in around ten dollars and i just want to state that the last like the wait, did i say how much the, the power bank was the power bank costs guys it costs around $20, maybe $18, something around that. That's for the power bank. But this headphone costs $10. They're headphones, not earphones, and to over ear. They are not as comfortable as my main headphones, which are which are wired and have that cushiony thing. But if you're if you're into Bluetooth, then you just you, you gotta get this one. It's like $10, and you can't go wrong with something like that. Bluetooth goes for about five hours. 5 hour battery life which is decent for something around 
And I highly recommend this if you're on a budget and looking for Bluetooth headphones. And yeah guys, that kind of concludes this best tech video. And if you didn't go enjoy it, go ahead and smash the like button. Why not check out my previous tech videos and obviously in the cards. And that's kind of like it for me, this is your boy aka signing off. Peace out. I mean, I really think you should.